Hi everybody, I hope you like this video. Um, I'm going to talk today about home staging. I, I talk about home staging all the time. I, I know I do, but I don't know that you really understand just how much it means. But some golden rules, five golden rules of home staging. And one is uh, obviously get rid of clutter. You know, closets, I tell all my people, we, you're going to move anyway. Let's get some of that stuff out of the closet. Make it feel like you have ample space. So uh, decluttering is just a basic thing, clean and declutter. But also there is uh, depersonalize. You know, I, I encourage people to take personal photos off of the walls. Leave them more open. Um, you know, open your windows, curtains, drapes. Make it feel light and bright. Make people feel like um, it's a really nice warm place to be so also maximizing your space you know um, we're always talking about you know how much furniture should I have well I always say just make the room um, clear clearly define what the room is and a great example is a bedroom you know a bedroom is a place most of us go to relax we go to go to sleep we go to get away from everything else if your bedroom is also your office and a workout room and a place where you sleep, that might not be sending the right message to your buyers. You might just want to have a nice simple bed and a nightstand, maybe call it a day right there. Just come in and relax. Um, that's supposed to be where you're going to be comfortable, right? And then bathrooms, of course, you know, clear off your countertops. Uh, you really don't need anything. In your bathroom you know people say well I like to have my soap containers out and all this stuff it's like you really don't need that you just need to have a nice clean bathroom and people will appreciate that because that's what they want they want to go into a nice clean bathroom and the kitchen you know you may want to update um, and it doesn't have to be a huge update it can just be your hardware it could just be refacing it could just be new things covers on your appliances there's a lot of ways to update but if your kitchen needs updating, it's probably a good idea to figure out some way to do a little bit of updating. Um, you know, and also, again, you know, clean. It has the refrigerator, the sink, the drawers, the, the cabinets, all that. It should be clean and welcoming. And then, uh, you know, we all, not we all, a lot of us have rugs. Uh, rugs in our bathrooms and rugs in our kitchens. Well, when you're trying to sell a house, it's not the best time to have a bunch of area rugs down because they break up the space, they make it feel a little bit smaller. So there's something to think about. And then dining rooms, you know, all the stagers put all this stuff out, you know, in a dining room. You've got 12-piece dinner, formal, with the two bowls and the three plates and all this stuff. You, you should set a nice table, but minimalize reduce the leaves table for two if it's that small table for four if it's that size fine you don't need a big huge table space is more valuable than the table and then of course keeping it neutral you know the, the again painting is neutral and then um I, whether it's your kitchen or your dining room you know maybe one vase with i say fruit flowers something on it that gives a little bit of color pop right but you're not going crazy. You're not throwing that everywhere. You're just throwing it like in one spot here, maybe one spot over there. And then, like I said, light. You know, in your living room especially, people want it light and bright. They, you know, open up, open up, open up those windows, open up those shades. Remove the curtains altogether. Remove the shades altogether if you can. If you're still living there, maybe that's not practical. But to the extent that you can, make sure everything's wide open. So I hope you found those uh, helpful. Be sure and like the video and follow me on Facebook.